It was the end of an era today for one of the last vestiges of the Industrial Revolution here in Western Massachusetts. 22 News reporter Cy Becker watched as the contents of the 154-year-old Hoyoke Machine Company were auctioned off. Up and running since 1863 when Abraham Lincoln was president, the equipment at Holyoke Machine finally fell silent in February. Uh, our primary market is paper and textile mills uh, throughout the country, but primarily in New England. Uh, last year, two large uh, paper mills in Maine closed. During the years of its peak performance, Holyoke Machine employed dozens of workers in the heart of what once was Holyoke's industrial Main Street heartland. But just before its closing earlier this year, there were but 20 employees. Alan Bernier of South Hadley was employed at Holyoke Machine Company for more than 30 years, and he was stunned by the closing. The first thing I did was go to a bar and get drunk, <laughs> because I was shocked. And then uh, the next thing I did was call my buddy, he was down in Florida, told him the bad news, and. Here we are. First, the small items were auctioned off to be followed by the massive machinery, which had helped drive Holyoke's robust economy for more than 150 years. At the old Holyoke Machine Company on Main Street, Cy Becker, 22 News.